Lord, for you are worthy to be Omega. He's the beginning. He's the ending. Hallelujah. He knows the end from the beginning. You know, he is, he was, and he will be. And because of that, we just want to give him praise. Hallelujah. Let's just do this next one. Lead me, Lord. I will follow. Because he's the omnipotent, omnipresent, omniscient God. So he knows the right way to lead us. Lead me, Lord. I will follow, lead me, Lord, I will go, for you have called me, and I will answer, lead me, Lord, I will go. Yes, lead us, Lord, we will follow, lead us, Lord, we will go, for you have called us, we'll answer, lead us, Lord, we Yes, lead us, Lord, and I will follow. Lead me, Lord, I will go. For you have called me, and I will answer. Lead me, Lord, I will. Yes, lead us, Lord, we will follow, lead me, Lord, I will go, for you have called me, and I will answer, lead me, Lord, I Bless Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Can we give the Lord a praise? Hallelujah. He's the ancient of days. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Bless the name, Jesus. You are worthy to be praised. Hallelujah. 
Hallelujah. Let's do this last one. His voice makes the difference. Let's all join in. Hallelujah. His voice makes the difference. When he speaks, he relieves my troubled mind. It's the only voice I hear that makes the difference. And I'll follow one day at a time. Yes, his voice, it makes a difference. When he speaks, he relieves my troubled mind. It's the only voice I hear that makes a difference. And I'll follow one day at a time. One more time. His voice, it makes a difference. When he speaks, he relieves my troubled mind. It's the only voice I hear that makes a difference. And I'll follow one day at a time. Yes, we will follow one day at a time. You know, we lift our faith to the Lord. And when he speaks, it just relieves us. It gives us such a peace, such a comfort, you know. And I just want to give the Lord thanks because He's always speaking to us. Whenever we cry to him, he's there listening. He, he's always attuned to our prayer. Bless God. I know turn over the service to, um, is it Minister Pemberton? Okay. Bless God. Praise the Lord. God bless you. It's fine. I'm just standing in for someone. So at this time, I'm going to share my screen with you for the logistics. Okay. So I'm sure most of us are very familiar with Zoom, but I'm just going to say a few things that will help us to enjoy the service even more than we already have so far. And God bless you, Sister Saunders, for your lovely praise and worship. So the service is being recorded. This is the first thing to note, it is being recorded. Um, as you can see here, you can either have gallery view or speaker view. If you want to be able to see whoever's speaking or ministering um, large on the screen, if you look, it's usually in the top right hand corner of your screen. And if you click on the little black box, you can select gallery view. If you want to see everyone who's on, but you can only see them one page at a time, please click on speaker view. To help the moderator, if you could please rename your device with your name, please. That would be wonderful. Thank you so much. We want you to enjoy the service and please praise with whoever is ministering, but we would ask you to stay muted unless you're asked by the moderator or anyone else to unmute that would be awesome if you have a prayer request please feel free to send it through the chat and your request will be answered at the end of the service god bless you also just to say that if you haven't already set up the tithely app you can do so on your phone or laptop or whatever device you've got and if you search for church of jesus christ apostolic Donald, SHF, S9, 4EU convocation, you will be able to give a contribution, give as much as you want to give, praise God, which is preparing you for later on for the offering and the giving session. If you'll be sending your donation in by post, if you could address the envelope for the attention of missionary Marcia Wells, Church of Jesus Christ Apostolic 778, Prince of Wales Road, Darnell, Sheffield, S94 EU. And if you'll be doing a bank transfer, if you could do that to the HSBC Bank, the sort code is 
5121111. And the account number is 5121450. The IBAN number you'll be transferring from abroad, it's GB07 HBUK 4041115121. Five zero zero. God bless you as you enjoy the service in Jesus' name. Over to Pastor Pemberton, our first moderator. God bless you, Pastor Pemberton. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. We praise the Lord. We praise the Lord. We give God thanks and praise. Let us all praise the Lord for this opportunity this wonderful and glorious opportunity that the Hallelujah. Lord has given us today. Hallelujah. Let us raise our hand and just give God thanks. Praise yeah. God, praise God, yeah. praise God. We give God thanks and praise this evening that we are here in our convocation. God has blessed us and he has kept us. We are a truly blessed people. And so here we are this evening, giving God thanks and praise for his spirit life and for keeping us. God is truly good. There's no failure in him at all. And because of that, let us continue to trust the Lord. Let us continue to serve him. Let us continue to worship him in spirit and in truth. And tonight I give God thanks one more time again that we are coming here in this convocation um, the second time on Zoom. Last year we was on and here we are again. And this time we have three nights, three days of holy convocation. This is wonderful. This is marvelous. God is good, it is sweet. Isn't it wonderful, wonderful? What a blessing, what a blessing. God is good to us. Oh, praise God, praise God. I'm just a bit excited over it. We give God thanks and praise this evening. <clears throat> As we have come, um, we give God all the praise tonight for this wonderful and glorious opportunity to be here. And uh, so therefore, I must first say greetings to our, greeting to our national bishop, Bishop Palmer, and to all the pastors and officers here, the workers of this great um, Zoom team, we give God thanks for each and every one of you tonight. We're doing a wonderful work. And so tonight, I would open up our convocation, our meeting tonight, <clears throat> on behalf of our national bishop, Dr. C.T. Richards, I would like to welcome you to the 45th, the 45th annual National Convocation of Church of Jesus Christ Apostolic UK. Let us all put our hands together and give God praise. Five years. Praise God, praise God. We thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank God. Thank God. It hasn't been easy, <clears throat> you know, to come 45 years, it's a long time, it's a journey. And this is a journey by faith. You know, there are times when people can give up, but when we know what God has done for us and where we are going and the God in whom we serve, we just continue to serve him in spirit and in truth. So we are grateful tonight for this glorious time for our 45th year of holy convocation. Let us enjoy this convocation. Let us give God thanks and praise, brethren, for we do not know if we will be here to see another one. So let us make sure that we use our time now of glorifying God and worshiping him and give him all the praise for this moment, for this time, that he has allowed us to be here in our 45th year of holy convocation. And so we give God thanks and we give praise and we are now going to have our opening song by Missionary Barrett in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord, God bless you. I'm gonna share this part. It will be Dharma Community Gospel Choir who will be singing. God bless you, thank you.
you in jesus name we praise the lord let's praise the lord let's praise the lord let's give god thanks for missionary barrett and all of the associates tonight let us give god thanks for them for such a wonderful wonderful song we give god thanks and praise to you all and at this time i'm going to ask deacon bailey deacon g bailey to pray in jesus name Deacon Bailey. So good. Praise God. Tonight I greet all the spirits tonight. Greet our bishops. It's all your brethren, praise God. Moderate in the precious name of Jesus. Praise God. Forever with the Lord, amen, so let it be. Savior divine, righteous judge, this evening, Lord God. Just want to give your chance and praise divine Savior. Worship and adore your name, Lord, because you are worthy. worthy. Oh, God, who could it be but Jesus this morning? At this time, Lord, you grant us life. Lord, when I wasn't thinking of you, oh, God, you were thinking of us. Divine Lord, you gave, you gave your life for us, Lord, because you love us. Praise God. The scripture told us, Lord, that greater love are no man than this. And we don't his life for his friend. Tonight, Lord God, we thank you for that friendship. Friendship with Jesus, oh, what bliss. You should love us, sing us such as us, Lord, tonight. O oh, righteous judge, King of kings, Lord of lords, he who bore all our sorrow, praise God, hallelujah. He who Christ is finished, man redemption is paid. Lord, you paid it all for us on Calvary's cross, Lord God. We thank you, O oh God, divine Savior. Lord, hallelujah. You shed your precious blood for us, Lord. Tonight, Lord God, we have a hope. Tonight, Lord God, we have a chance. Tonight, Lord God, we have assurance. Your scripture told us, Lord, just turn one more simple ways, O God, and seek your face. Then will we hear from heaven. Hallelujah. Lord, we need to hear from heaven at this time. Divine Savior, thank you, O God, for this precious moment. Lord, as we go into the first day of our convocation, Lord God, Divine Savior, inviting your divine presence. Lord, you come among us, Lord Jesus. Praise God, hallelujah. Touch you not for your children, Lord. Praise God, hallelujah. That soul may be saved. Soul will fill with the Holy Ghost. Soul will be baptized the band Savior. In the name of Jesus. Oh God, bless your convocation, Lord. We pray our bishops. Oh God, our elders. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Moderate at this time. Praise God. Our missionaries, our deacons. Evangelists at this time, Lord. Bless some of your children. 
Oh God, hallelujah. Bless this service, Lord, we pray. Lord, we put everything into thine hands. Lord, we're depending on thee, Lord God, because without you there, oh God, of oh, this meeting will be in vain. But divine Savior and our King, in the name of Jesus, Lord, we look to the ears, Lord, from whence cometh our help. Know that our help cometh from thee, which made the heaven and the earth. Bless and sanctify, Lord God, we pray. Oh God, those that are sick, praise God, hallelujah. Those that are weak, Lord, strengthen them, Lord, we pray, as we ask these mercies. In Jesus' holy name, amen. Praise, Praise God. the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise, Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. We give God. Praise God. Praise God. Give God thanks tonight for this wonderful prayer from Deacon Bailey in Jesus' name. And now we will proceed by having our scripture reading by Sister A. Jones, which will be taken from 1 John chapter 5, verse 1 to 14. Sister A. Jones will lead us into our scripture reading. And after the reading of the scripture, we, will, we are going to have a chorus from Missionary J. Grant in Jesus' name. Scripture reading, please. Greetings, everyone. Here beginneth the reading of God's holy word, 1 John 5, 1 to 14. Whosoever believeth that Jesus is the Christ is born of God, and everyone that loveth him, that begot, loveth him also, that is begotten of him. By this we know that we love the children of God, when we love God and keep his commandments. For this is the love of God, that we keep his commandments, and his commandments are not grievous. For whatsoever is born of God overcometh the world, and this is the victory that overcometh the world, even our faith. Who is he that overcometh the world, but he that believeth that Jesus is the Son of God? This is he that came by water and blood, even Jesus Christ, not by water only, but by water and blood. And it is the Spirit that beareth witness, because the Spirit is true. For there are three that bear record in heaven, the Father, the Word, and the Holy Ghost, and these three are one. And there are three that bear witness in the earth, the Spirit, and the water, and the blood. And these three agree in one. If we receive the witness of men, the witness of God is greater. For this is the witness of God, which he have testified of his son. He that believeth on the son of God have the wit witness in himself. He that believeth not God have made him a liar because he believeth not the record that God gave of his son. And this is the record that God have given to us eternal life. And this life is in his son. He that have the Son have life, and he that have not the Son of God have not life. These things have I written unto you that believe on the name of the Son of God, and that ye may know that ye have eternal life, and that ye may believe on the name of the Son of God. And this is the confidence that we have in him, that if we ask anything according to his will, he heareth us. Amen. Here endeth the reading of God's holy word. We praise the Lord. We praise the Lord. We give God thanks for the reading of his holy word this evening. We praise God tonight. And so we will have a chorus from Hallelujah. Missionary J. Grant in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We come to glorify the, the name of the Lord. Praise we come to magnify the name of the Lord. This is our Holy convocation to the Amen. sing the chorus with me in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. You can tell the world about this. You can tell the nation to go back. Tell them that Jesus has come. Tell them that the comforter has come. It brings joy to my soul. It brings joy to my soul. You can tell the world. You can tell the nation to go back, tell them that Jesus has come, tell them that the cup is poor has come. It brings joy to my soul, it brings joy to my soul. You can tell the world about 
Jesus name. Thank Amen. you, missionary grant. Wonderful, lively as usual. We give God thanks and praise for you this evening in Jesus name. Keep singing for the Lord love. May God bless you. And at this time, we give God thanks and praise for all of our international bishops, all of them. Time will fail to call names. So I'm saying to all of our international bishop, greeting in the most wonderful, precious name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, and all of our national bishop. We give God thanks and praise for each and every one of you, for this is a journey by faith. By faith, we have come this far leaning on the Lord, trusting in his holy word. We give God thanks and we give him praise this evening for such a wonderful and glorious opportunity in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. So we will just continue here at this time. We are going to have our first expression, one from London by Elder B. Thomas. Our first expression will be given by Elder B. Thomas, London. 10 minutes, my brother, in Jesus' name. 10 minutes. Hallelujah, glory Praise to the God. Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Glory to your name, glory to Amen. God. Amen. Hallelujah, this is convocation. Where we come to Praise exalt the, the name of the Praise Lord. The Lord. And then where we come with our cups turned up. Hallelujah. We receive from the Lord. Hallelujah. <laughs> Glory to God. Glory to God. Yes. We're here to worship the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I exalt his name. I lift up his name. Because his name is worthy to be praised. Hallelujah. From the uprising of the sun unto the going down of the very same. Glory to God. His name is worthy to be praised. Hallelujah, hallelujah. I honor my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, who is the head of my life. Praise God. I want to take, you know, give special greetings to our presiding international bishop, Bishop McCoy. Praise God. Our national presiding bishop, Bishop Dr. C.T. Richards. Praise God. All the ministers, all the household of faith, the boards of bishop. Praise God. Ministers, saints of the most high God, family of God. Greetings in the precious name of Jesus. And I bring holy greetings also for my pastor, the Honorable Reverend E.J. Ferguson, praise God. Due to circumstances, she's not online on tonight. But praise God, we are here to exalt the name of Jesus. Praise God. There's a, an, an old school chorus come to mind. I might just hum uh, maybe a quick line of it. It goes like this. Our God over, over, my soul looks back and wonder. Our God over, our God over, over, my soul looks back and wonders, our God over, one more time, our God over, over, my soul looks back and wonders. Oh, 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 oh. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Bring all the greetings also for my darling wife who's here tonight to hold up my hands. Praise God. <laughs> Praise God. We're here to worship tonight. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. I love the Lord and I love the church. I love the ministry and I love the word of God. It is my food every day. Praise God. The word of God tells us that man shall not live by natural bread alone, but by the word that proceeded out of the mouth of God doth man live. Praise God. And look at this, this scripture tonight. Our topic, praise God, is our faith 
overcomes the world. Sorry? No, the um, angry ones at the top. Praise God. Um, yeah, the topic says, our faith overcomes the world. Um, John, the purpose of John writing this epistle to the Christian was to give them assurance of eternal life, which they now have. We believe that Jesus Christ is the Son of God. Uh, this uncertainty, the uncertainty came about because of teachers of false doctrines. John called them false prophets. According, according to chapter 2, verse 19, they were backsliders who had departed from the faith. So John wrote this epistle to encourage the saints of God that the faith which they have, the faith that they're in, is the true faith, and they must build their confidence and their faith, and rest, they can rest upon that, that pray that they're in the right faith, and they're serving the right God. Praise God. Tonight, I look back in my own life, one of the topics, topics is our faith overcome the world. And I would say, my faith, because I've accepted this doctrine, I've accepted this teaching, I'm where I am tonight. Because, of the, because I, I've search the scriptures and I found that what is written is true and I've rest my hope and my confidence on the word of God and Jesus says in this world we shall have tribulation but he told the disciples be of good cheer because he has overcome the world and we are here we are where we are tonight because of the word of God and we pattern our lives after our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ because the suffering that we're going through or may, may have been through, the Bible says, you know, the sufferings, of the, the sufferings of this life is not worthy to be compared with the hope that we have in Christ Jesus. So Jesus Christ encouraged the disciples must be of good shape because he has overcome the world. And the faith that we have in Christ Jesus tonight, we can stand fast on it. Praise God. Uh, the Bible says, faith cometh by hearing, and hearing by the word of God. So the more we hear the word of God, the more we feast upon the word of God, is the stronger we're going to become. And we don't know what's coming in the future, but where we are tonight, praise God, I believe that we can stand steadfastly, we can stand flat-footed on the word of God, Believing that what we have received is the true doctrine. And we know that the Antichrist is already here. John warned, warned the, 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 the church about the Antichrist and false prophets. We are living this time. They are here right now. Because uh, Paul in, in uh, 2 Timothy chapter 3, he said, This know also that in the last days perilous times shall come, for men shall be lovers of their own self. And he, he gives that description of, you know, the type of spirits Amen. That, you know, that's floating around in the world today. But saints of God tonight, I want to encourage you praise Amen. God that we are in the right faith. Praise God. And we have overcome the world, and that's why we're here tonight. But let me encourage you tonight that there are many out there which need to be in the same position. And the reason why I believe that the Lord has not taken the church out of the world yet because there are still many souls out there. I, would, I wouldn't say, that I wouldn't say millions, but I would say billions of souls are still out there. And we are the light that they're looking to. God has got here. Jesus said, while he was in the world, he was the light of the world. And we are here still to be that light to those Amen. who are in darkness. So let us continue to be steadfast. Let our light shine, praise God. So they that in the world will see us. They'll see our good works come to glorify our Father which is in heaven. So tonight uh, my beloved family of God saints of the most high God Amen. be steadfast and unmovable and always abounding in the work of the Lord for this we do know that our labor is not in vain. In Amen. The Lord. God bless you in Jesus Christ. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. We give God thanks for you Elder Thomas. We give God thanks for you this evening. For your words of expression, may God continue to bless you and your lovely wife 
also in Jesus' name. Let me just say, because I have already greeted the international and national bishops, you only have 10 minutes, so you don't have to go through that greeting again to take up the time. Use your 10 minutes for ministering the word. So we'll have our second expression by Elder Paul White from Leeds in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise God. Oh, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise Hallelujah. God. Hallelujah. Praise God. Through it all. Through it all. I've learned to trust in Jesus. I've learned to trust in God. Through it all. Through it all. I've learned to depend upon his word. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Holy greetings, beloved, beloved. Now are we children of God. Hallelujah. Thank you so much. Bless God for having me this evening. Praise God. And I'm here also to share in this wonderful topic. Bless God. Our faith overcomes the world. Blessed greetings to our national bishop and international bishops. Bless the Lord and all our saints. I love you, I love you, I love you. Praise God. Our faith overcomes the world. Bless the name of Jesus. Now, patience, bless God, is an important ingredient of faith. Bless God. And as I sought, bless God, to get something more out of this uh, topic, as you know, each time, bless God, we touch on particular subject, bless God, we seek for deeper understanding, bless the name of Jesus. And I'm just gonna look at, Certain ingredient in faith, bless the name of the Lord. And what I see here is that faith, uh, uh, patience, bless God, patience is one key ingredient of faith, bless God. The Holy Bible gives us grounds of adequately so uh, you know giving us adequate supporting evidence bless god of those who have been through the fire those who have been through the flood those who have been tested and tried bless god hence the apostle went on to say i have fought a good fight. I have finished my course and I've kept the faith. Bless God. In Hebrews 10 and 13, it says, for whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Bless God. And as you go down further in that chapter, it says, faith, bless God, comes by hearing, bless God, and hearing by the word of God. Hallelujah. Therefore, the scripture says, do not cast away your confidence, which has great reward, for you have need of endurance so that after you have done the will of God, you may receive the promise. Bless God. Now, 
in Hebrews 10, 36, 38, it says, now the just shall live by faith. But if anyone draws back, my soul has no pleasure in him. Bless God. We wait on God. Bless the name of Jesus. And sometimes the wait seem very long. Bless the name of Jesus. But we have the patriarchs. Bless the name of Jesus. And those who have their lives were tested and tried. Naming also Job, bless the name of the Lord, of which by his experience, it has given us the opportunity to examine the faith of Job, praise God, to see that the key component that allowed him to overcome in his adversity was patience. Bless God. It is his healing, his recovery didn't come overnight. Bless God. But he declared in his own words, all my appointed time, I'm going to wait until change comes. Bless God. Is there a heart tonight? Bless God. You have prayed and it seems as if, you know, there is no results from your prior. Let me tell you something. Bless God. The word of God promises healing. Praise God. So that after you have exercised your faith, exercised your patience, bless God, then bless the name of Jesus, the healing will come. The healing will manifest. Bless the name of the Lord. I have proven this, that the God of Israel, he answers prior, bless the name of the Lord, and that patience is a virtue, bless God. And as a young brother growing up in the Lord, I started to learn of Christ that the things that my heart desires Amen. come by patience and virtue. Amen. God bless your hearts tonight. Continue to grow in the power of the grace of God through believing that he will bring you through in Jesus' name. Amen. We give God praise thanks for God. your expression, Elder White. We give God thanks and praise tonight because we are living by faith. And the book of Hebrews, uh, this chapter 11 is a book of faith that tells us about all those who have gone by faith. It said, Abraham, when he was tried, offered up Isaac, and he yes. that received the promises of offered up the only begotten son by faith tonight. We give God thanks and we give him praise. And at this time, I'm going to have a chorus by missionary G. Grant. And Hallelujah. I take the opportunity Hallelujah. of turning back the rest of this service this evening to Elder Horton in the most wonderful and the precious name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, J. Hallelujah. Grant. Praise God. Praise Thank God. you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. I'm riding with Jesus on the Hallelujah train. I'm singing and shouting on the Hallelujah train. And when I reach that station, heaven is my destination. I'm riding with Jesus. Hallelujah train, I'm riding with Jesus on the Hallelujah train. I'm singing, I'm shouting on the Hallelujah 
Jesus on the hallelujah train. I'm singing, I'm I'm shouting on the hallelujah train. And when I reach that station, heaven is my destination. I'm rising with Jesus on the hallelujah train. And when I reach that station, heaven is my destination. Praise the Lord, let us unmute, let us unmute and give God thanks, let us unmute, give God thanks, praise the Lord, 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 praise
We will understand it better by and by. Oh yes, when Christ was on earth, he fed the multitude with five little lords and two small fish. Oh yes, he raised the dead and caused the blind to see. We will understand it better by and by. Hallelujah, bye, bye. When the morning comes, when all the saints and saints of God are gathered all, we will tell, tell the story how we overcome. We will understand it better by and by. Oh, by and by, by and by. When the morning comes, when all the saints of God are gathered all, we will tell the story how we overcome. We will understand it better by and by. Oh, we will understand, we will understand it better by and by. Oh, we will understand, oh, we will understand it better by and by. Hallelujah, hallelujah, glory, hallelujah, hallelujah, thank you, Jesus, glory, hallelujah, hallelujah, thank you, Jesus, thank you, Lord, hallelujah, thank you, Jesus. That's God. God. Thank you, Mr. Judith, for that wonderful song. I take great pleasure at this time in handing part of this service over to the National Bishop of Church of Jesus Christ Apostolic in the UK. Please receive Bishop C.T. Richards in Jesus' name. Bless the Lord, bless the Lord, bless the Lord. Amen. Let us all praise the Lord this afternoon. Let us give him bless honor. Him. Let us lift him up. Amen. He's a great God. Praise Amen. The Lord. In all this, some is that he will not leave us comfortless, Thank you, Jesus. but Thank he will come God. unto us. And so let us give him praise and let us honor him tonight for his goodness to us, yes, amen, the children of men. I give God thanks for all the songs and the uh, choruses that have gone forth. Give God thanks for the true expression, amen, that has gone forth, amen, uh, talking about the faith that we have in Christ Jesus. And not only so, but the faith that allows us to overcome the world, because what is going on in the world at this time, amen, it will pull us down if we do not have faith in God. So we give God praise this evening, knowing that he has kept us over this period of time so that we are able at this point just to praise him. Amen. We come to a point in our service in which we are ready to listen to the words of God. Amen. And the Bible tells us that the word, they are spirit and they are life. And so this evening we are looking forward that life will come to us by the word. The Bible said he sent his word to heal us. And so in all that we are doing, we just have to give him praise and honor to know that he sent his word to heal us. And so if we are in dire strait at this time, I'm just asking that we look to God, that when the word of God comes to us, amen, it will be of such this evening that whether we need it to be healed, whether we need it to be delivered, whether we, we need, amen, something that we were praying for, God will grant it unto us. Our faith, our faith overcomes the world because it's not just a simple faith that we have because the faith that we have in Christ Jesus, the word of God said upon this rock, I will build my church and the gates of hell shall not prevail against it. So the faith that we have in him is a rock faith that we can stay in God 
and be built up. So at this time, amen, I want to present to you a young man. I've known him uh, a few years and I've noticed that he is very, very zealous after God. Amen. He loves the word of God. Amen. He at times is ambitious. Amen. When it comes to God. Amen. He has a passion for the word. He loves people. Amen. And one of his word that he speaks in most time is thank God for life. Amen. Life in itself is a great commodity. And so this evening, I want us to put our hands together. Amen. As he comes to us in the person of Minister O'Neill Raymond Bligin. As he comes to us, let us pray for him that God will bless him and bless us together in the name of Jesus Christ. At this time, Receive him and hear the word. God bless you in Jesus' name. Praise God. Praise God. Yes, yes. Clap your hands for the Lord, somebody. Hallelujah. Yes, yes, yes. Hallelujah. 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 Praise God. We give God thanks for his love and for his kindness, for his grace and his mercies. Praise God. Thank you, Bishop Richards, for such a wonderful introduction praise god hallelujah it's good to be alive praise god hallelujah isn't life sweet praise god hallelujah you don't have to worry praise god hallelujah because jesus is with us praise god praise god it's good it's good it's good to be in our 45th hallelujah national hallelujah annual national holy convocation praise god hallelujah it's good last year we were here Praise God. And this year we are here again. Praise God. Last year was only one day, one night. Praise God. This year we have three. So there is an increase. Praise God. So we bless the Lord for increase. Praise God. I want to praise God. Give God thanks for the household of faith. Praise God. And special greetings to our international presider, Bishop McCoy. Praise God. Bishop Brett. Praise God. If he's on, Bishop Hebert. If he's on, Praise God and our national bishop, Bishop Dr. C.T. Richards, praise God, my pastor, praise God, and Pastor Richards also. Special greeting to Bishop Palmer and Mother Palmer, Bishop Raymond Williams, praise God. I think I glimpsed him somewhere there, praise God. Hallelujah, God is good. And my pastor from Jamaica, Pastor Miriam Thompson, praise God, is on also. So greeting to all the saints there, praise God, in Lancaster, Jamaica, praise God, hallelujah, praise God, elder, modest greetings, praise God, our moderator, praise God, all our pastors tonight and elders, praise God, deacons, missionaries, ministers, praise God, saints from Mount Peniel, praise God, accept greeting in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, our soon coming king, praise God, hallelujah, God is good, hallelujah, I'm glad, praise God, that I've been given this opportunity, praise God, to speak at the first night of the feast, praise God, of our holy convocation, praise God. It is an opportunity, praise God, and I give God thanks, praise God, for this opportunity, praise God. Hallelujah, I want to give God thanks for my beautiful wife, Evangelist Bligion, praise God, who is always beside me, praise God, hallelujah, seen that I go well, praise God, hallelujah. As the scripture says, Solomon said in Proverbs, praise God, hallelujah, that whoso findeth a wife, praise God, findeth a good thing, praise God, and obtaineth favor of the Lord. So tonight I can say, I'm favored, hallelujah, praise God. You are favored too. If you believe you're favored by the Lord, come on, wave your hand for Jesus, praise God, hallelujah. We are favored by the Lord, praise God, hallelujah, God. Is good. I believe my mom is also on, praise God, missionary religion, praise God. So I give God thanks for her also. If it wasn't for her, praise God, I wouldn't be here. Praise God. So I give God thanks. Praise God. We have tonight, praise God. I'm going to get to work. Praise God. Hallelujah. We have a lovely scripture tonight. Praise God, which, which is uh, come to us tonight from 1 John chapter 5, 1 through four, the 14th verse. Praise God. I won't read. All the verses, praise God, but I will read 
praise God, the first five verse, praise God, hallelujah. And it goes, whosoever believe that Jesus is the Christ is born of God. And everyone that loveth him that begot, loveth him also that is begotten of him. By this, we know that we love the children of God. When we love God and keep his commandments. For this is the love of God, that we keep his commandments. And his commandments are not grievous. Praise God. Hallelujah. Let me say that again. The commandments of the Lord are not grievous. They are not burdensome. Praise God. Hallelujah. They are good. Hallelujah. David sees them to be perfect. Praise God. He sees them to be sweeter than the honeycomb. Praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God. Verse 4 says, For whatsoever is born of God overcometh the world. And this is the victory. This is the victory that overcometh the world. Even our faith. Even our faith. The apostle asks a question, who is he that overcometh the world? But he that believeth that Jesus is the son of God. Let us pray. Righteous, eternal father, God, we give you thanks. We give you praise. We give you the honor and the glory. We thank you for this moment, oh God. You knew that it was coming. Hallelujah. Because you see all things. And tonight, Lord, as we come together, Lord God, I pray that you may bless your people. Oh, God Almighty, with the word that you have jumped within my spirit. Oh, God Almighty, when everything is done, God, we pray that you will be glorified. Oh, God, and your people will be edified. God and Satan will be glorified in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. Praise God, praise God, praise God. Hallelujah. We have a wonderful uh, topic uh, tonight, a uh, theme, praise God. And our theme tonight is our faith overcomes the world. That, that is beautiful. That's a beautiful statement. Praise God. And we give God thanks for our leaders who have put this together. Praise God. Our faith overcomes the world. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. I want to make a statement. This statement is that faith is one of the greatest tool God has given to us. Faith. It is one of the greatest tool God has given unto mankind, unto humanity. Praise God. Hallelujah. But the question is, praise God, what is faith? What is faith? Faith have many different definitions for faith. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. But tonight, what we are dealing with tonight, praise God, we are dealing with the faith, praise God, which means a complete trust are confident in something or someone. Praise God. That is the faith we are dealing with tonight. A complete trust. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. In something or someone. Praise God. Hallelujah. And, and I, when I think of the, 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 the theme that we have here, and when I think of faith, what comes to my mind, praise God, is that evil, praise God, prior to now, praise God, Hallelujah. When, when, when you're getting ready for this Zoom meeting, praise God. Hallelujah. You probably just, hallelujah, just pull your, your chair. Praise God. Or you just sit in the couch. Praise God. Without even thinking of, can this thing hold my weight? Praise God. Hallelujah. The thing is that you have faith in that chair that you're sitting on now. You have confidence in it that it will hold your body weight. Praise God. Hallelujah. That is trust. Praise God. Hallelujah. But it's trust that and faith that we are talking about, praise God, is the faith in Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The confidence in him. Praise God. Hallelujah. That whatever he says, praise God. Hallelujah. That's the way it goes. Hallelujah, somebody. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. We ought to put our trust and our confident in the Almighty God. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. The next question is, why is faith so important? Why is faith so important? Praise God. We deal shortly in a nutshell, what is faith? Praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. 
praise God. But the next question I have, praise God, why is faith so important? Because of Hebrews chapter 11, verses 6, which declares, but without faith, it is impossible to please him. Hallelujah. Somebody. Hallelujah. I want you to preach with me. Praise God. Hallelujah. He said, but without faith, impossible. it is impossible to please him. Him That's who? Right. God. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. I hear somebody sing a song. Hallelujah. That God specializes in the things that yeah, seem most impossible. impossible. Praise God. But here, praise God, the author of Hebrew is saying, praise God, hallelujah, that it is impossible to please God without, without faith. Praise God Almighty. God specialized in impossible stuff. It was God who part the Red Sea. Hallelujah. That the church, the early church, praise God, Israel, cross and dry land. Hallelujah. It was Jesus who was God, who is God in the flesh. Praise God Almighty, the call by dead people to life. Hallelujah. It is Jesus, hallelujah, who healed the blind man. Those are impossible stuff. Hallelujah. It is Jesus, hallelujah, who fed 5,000 men plus women and children. Praise God with a boy's lunch. Five loaves and two fishes. Those are impossible stuff. Hallelujah. Praise be to God. Hallelujah. But God specialized. In impossible stuff. Yes, it does. But your faith is so important tonight. Praise God that without this, without your faith, it is impossible to please him. Praise God. He declares that for he that cometh to God must believe that he yes. is. Hallelujah. Praise God. He is. Hallelujah. You cannot predict God. God is a present God. He is. My God, he is. He's present. Oh, my God. You cannot predict him. He is now. He's present. He's a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. When we seek God diligently, hallelujah, he will reward us ah, supernaturally. Hallelujah. 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 When we seek the Lord, Diligently seek me to ponder, to search, to meditate, to dig, want to find out more about God. Hallelujah. And when we, we do these things, our faith will grow in God. Hallelujah. I may have lost <laughs> some things, but I've never lost my faith. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I've lost many things in life. Uh, hallelujah, hallelujah. But guess what? Guess what? Hallelujah. I have kept the faith. Praise God. Hallelujah. When we lose our faith, we're out for problem. We can't please God if we lose our faith, church. Hallelujah. We cannot please God if we lose our faith. Hallelujah. Without faith, you cannot forgive your brothers nor yourself without faith. You, you cannot, you cannot forgive your brothers without it because uh, you're thinking that that person will do the same thing. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. There is no faith uh, to see that that brother won't do it again. Uh, without faith, you cannot forgive your brother. Without faith, you would not be able to grow up your children. My God, many a times I hear my mother said, Hallelujah, Lord, give me faith with this boy. My God, give me faith, Lord. Hallelujah. Praise God Almighty. I can heard. Hallelujah. The mothers, hallelujah. Sometimes their children give them trouble. Hallelujah. All they can ask for is, Lord, give me faith to deal with this child. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Without faith, we wouldn't be able. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Without faith, oh my God, hallelujah. Oh, your prayers have no legs to stand on. Without faith, your prayers have no legs to stand on. Without faith, it doesn't make sense we pray. My God, 
faith is important. Hallelujah. Without faith, you cannot start your ministry. Without faith, you cannot start your own business. Without faith, you cannot overcome this world of ungodly system without faith. We cannot overcome the world's ungodly system without faith. Hallelujah. Praise God. Without faith, you cannot, we cannot receive salvation without faith hallelujah praise god as ephesians 2 verses yes and for by grace are you saved through faith and that not of yourselves it is the gift of god hallelujah it is faith is so important hallelujah we must understand hallelujah it's a reminder because i know you know Hallelujah, but for those who don't know, hallelujah, you need faith to make it. Without faith, there is no salvation. Hallelujah, hallelujah, as children of God, according to 2 Corinthians 5, 7, for we walk by faith. Hallelujah, we walk by faith. It's not a literal walking, but we live. It's our lifestyle. Hallelujah, by faith and not by sight. Uh, the world sees things by sight. Uh, hallelujah. We as children of God uh, cannot be driven by sight. That's the plan of the enemy. Praise God. My brother have a nice car. I need one too. Hallelujah. Praise God. You have a nice house. I need one too. Hallelujah. The world is doing this. Praise God. Hallelujah. The new norm church are doing this. Praise God Almighty. Hallelujah. It's all sight. But we are walking by faith. In the name of Jesus, come on, can somebody wave their hand for Jesus? Hallelujah, can somebody clap their hand for the Lord? Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. The thing is, how, 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 there's another question. How can I obtain faith? How, 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 how? Praise God. But according to Romans 17, 10, 17, this is what he said. So then faith cometh by hearing, my Lord. Hallelujah. This is how we obtain it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Some debate that, that it's a gift. Praise God. But some debate that it's a fruit. Faith is, is not a gift. And, and faith is a fruit. And all debate. But I know that this is the way it comes because of the word. It's a sudden faith cometh by hearing and hearing by the word of God. God, hallelujah, praise God. Our faith is built when the preacher preach. Hallelujah, praise God. Our faith is built when the teacher teach on the word of God. Our faith is built when we read the word of God. Our faith is built when we study the word of God. It comes by hearing and hearing by the word of God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. We are where we are today. Hallelujah. Because of the word that we hear day and night. Hallelujah. We are living a lifestyle today because of the word of God. Praise God Almighty. Hallelujah. 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 The thing is, is that our belief is important to us. Our belief is important to us. Every person came into this world without knowing anything. Praise God. And praise God, their belief system, praise God, is formed and built by their culture. Praise God. Hallelujah. By your parents or your family. Praise God. The belief system is built by the educational system also. Hallelujah, praise God, hallelujah. So sometimes this can be detrimental to people whose system isn't right. Praise God Almighty, hallelujah. But the thing is that, that when you're, you came into the world, natural, praise God. But the new birth, hallelujah. The new birth is the same thing. Hallelujah, when you're born, when Christ is born in us because of our leaders, Praise God Almighty, because of the heaven culture that they taught. Oh, God Almighty, we grow up, hallelujah, hallelujah, knowing the right thing to do. Hallelujah, can somebody clap their hands for victory tonight? Hallelujah, can somebody clap their hands for victory tonight? Hallelujah, hallelujah, praise God. Let, let, let me go in the scripture, praise God. Let me go in the scripture for a little while. Hallelujah, hallelujah. But as John 
things. We understand that he is an eyewitness. Yes, yes, we understand that he walked with Jesus. You have seen him, hallelujah. You have handled him, hallelujah. You have talked with him. John was there, praise God, on the Mount of Transfiguration, according to the scripture, Matthew 10, 17, which declares, hallelujah, that Jesus transfigured before them. His face becomes as the sun. The scripture declares that his raiment becomes as light, hallelujah. And out of the cloud comes the voice said, this is my beloved son in whom I'm well pleased. John was there, hallelujah, hallelujah. The message came to the disciples, hallelujah, that Jesus is not in the tomb. The scripture said, hallelujah, hallelujah, that the younger disciple outran Peter. Hallelujah, we see this to be John, hallelujah. What I'm saying, John saw the open grave of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, he saw the open grave of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah, he saw Jesus hanging on the cross. Oh, yes, 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 so he's a credible witness. Hallelujah, we can believe his testimony. Praise God, hallelujah. Jesus was hanging on the cross. He did not see any of his disciples, any other disciple. He did not see his brothers or his sisters. But when he looked, he saw his mother. When he looked, he saw John. He gave John a responsibility. He said, John, take care of my mother. John is credible. He is credible. Praise God Almighty. Hallelujah. John is not explaining God. John is testifying, and sometimes I find it hard to try to explain God because I cannot explain God. I can only give my experience. I can only experience God. I cannot explain it. John is not explaining God here. John is giving his witness of who Jesus is. My God. Hallelujah, hallelujah. So we know that he's credible. Hallelujah, it seems, it seems, hallelujah, it seems, it seems like false prophets and teachers has crept in in the church, hallelujah. Praise God Almighty, hallelujah, teaching something different. Their, their idea, praise God Almighty, is discrediting the incarnation of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah, they are disputing, hallelujah, God made flesh. That is what they're doing. Hallelujah, so John, 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 write to the brethren. Hallelujah, and say to them, look here. Hallelujah, say, whosoever believe that Jesus is, is born of God. Let me say that again. Whosoever believe that Jesus is the Christ. That's the word. I can't leave that out. Praise God. Whoever, anyone, anyone believe that Jesus is the Christ. The anointing one, the Messiah, praise God, is born of God. My God. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Iman, Iman is saying, listen, listen, it doesn't matter if you're white. It doesn't matter if you're black. It doesn't matter if you're rich or you're poor. It doesn't matter if you're healthy or you're unhealthy. It doesn't matter where you're from. It doesn't matter if you live in the United Kingdom or the United States of America. It doesn't matter if you live in Africa or the Caribbean. Hallelujah. He declares that whosoever, anyone that believe, 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 we have to believe this, we have to believe this, hallelujah, hallelujah, you see here, believe is a verb, praise God, hallelujah, it calls for action, it calls for action, it's an action word, Praise God Almighty, hallelujah. And let us try to define belief a bit for you. Praise God Almighty. No, no, no. You hear, you heard on your airwaves, praise God, or on the internet. That a storm is going to have used this all the while. Praise God. You heard that a storm is going to make landfall in the next 12 hours. Praise God Almighty. But because you believe that news that you, you hear, praise God, what you start to do, praise God, hallelujah, is to get up and leave me alone preaching. Hallelujah. And you will run to the food store. Praise God. You will get some tin goods. Praise God. You will get your lanterns. You will get, to, uh, praise God Almighty, some stuff that you need. Why? Because you believe that that storm is coming. Hallelujah. So tonight, may I submit to you, praise God Almighty, if you believe that Jesus 
is the Christ is born of God, whoever believe. Praise God Almighty. Hallelujah. It's called for action. 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 Praise God Almighty. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. For God so loved the world uh, that he gave his only begotten son, uh, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He loved the world. Praise God Almighty. He died for us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. This is the only way we can overcome is to believe Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. 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 Can, can we wave our hands for Jesus? Can we wave our hands for Jesus? Oh, he's worthy to be praised. He's worthy to be praised. He's worthy to be lifted up. Come on, can somebody worship the Lord? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. The thing is that Praise God. But when you're born of Christ, uh, when Jesus is born in us, praise God, we, we don't do the things we used to do. Somebody sing that the uh, things I used to do, I do it no more. Hallelujah. Place I used to go, I go there no more because I'm born again. Hallelujah. I'm born again. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. I am a witness of born again person. Hallelujah, I am a witness of a born again person. Praise God Almighty. Hallelujah, remember years gone by. Praise God Almighty when I wasn't in the church. Praise God, hallelujah, I lived with my mom and my pop. Hallelujah, praise God Almighty. But guess what? Hallelujah, hallelujah, I wasn't a Christian. Hallelujah. And guess what? I smoke the devil's vegetable. Praise God Almighty. Hallelujah. I smoke the cannabis. Praise God Almighty. Yes, 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 yes. I smoke the cannabis. So I will left from my home in the evening shower and left for the road. Then I will meet up my friends on the street and I will smoke. And I, if anything is there to drink, I will drink it also. Hallelujah. And when certain hours pass and it's time to go back home, I will go home in the wee of the night. Praise God. But because of sometimes these hallelujah cannabis, praise God, when they are not good, praise God, when you smoke them, you become hungry. Praise God Almighty. You will eat what you don't see. Hallelujah. You will eat what you don't see because these weeds, cannabis, is not good. So I will smoke some that is not good. Praise God. Hallelujah. And I will go home. And as I step into the house, praise God Almighty. Hallelujah. Probably my mom and my pop is sleeping. Hallelujah. And I will step into the refrigerator. Praise God. And I will devour what I see in there. Because of what I smoke, uh, I will step in the cupboard and I will eat what I see in there. Hallelujah. With no regard. Uh, hallelujah. My parents. Uh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Don't even want to do nothing in the yard, but want to eat everything that is provided. Hallelujah. But that was when I was under the culture of the world. Uh, hallelujah. But thanks be to God. Thanks be to God. Uh, hallelujah. It's a great change. Since I was born, hallelujah, but because I'm born again, hallelujah, hallelujah, I don't have to eat uh, what is in there. This time, because I'm born again, I bring stuff in the house. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. It's a great change since I was born. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. What an experience. I don't know about you. Hallelujah. I don't know what you've been through. Hallelujah. But what I've been through, praise God Almighty. Hallelujah. I've kept me until this day because every time my feet cross over, I know that that is not a, a born again child of God. God, hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. If you're glad to be born again, come on, wave your hand for Jesus, hallelujah. Oh, yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. The man of God says, the man of God says, that our victory, hallelujah, lies within faith. 
Verse 4 said, for whatsoever or anyone is born of God overcometh the world. My God, sometimes we take this so lightly, but, but, but this is so heavy. It's, it's so heavy. Oh God, hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. For whatsoever is born of God overcome the world. You and I are overcomers. My God, hallelujah, hallelujah. We must overcome the world. Praise God to be the light in the world. We must overcome it. He said, and this is the victory that overcometh the world, even our faith. Faith. Oh my God, hallelujah. Faith is like key. My God, hallelujah. I think, praise God, is Hebrew 11 verses 1 who define that faith is the substance of things. Faith is the substance of things. Faith is the substance of things. When you mix your faith with the word of God, praise God Almighty, hallelujah, you're going to see miracle. Oh, you will be able to forgive oh, your neighbor. You'll be able to forgive your brother. You'll be able to forgive your wife. When you mix it, my God, hallelujah, how am I doing? Hallelujah, praise God Almighty. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. He said, faith is the substance. Faith is the substance, substance of things. Faith is the substance of things. Hope for. Substance of what? Things. Hope for. So let us try to go a bit deeper on this. Praise God. Hallelujah. That we can understand the power that we have in faith. Praise God. It is the substance of things hope for. So then you may, you might need an egg sandwich. Oh, yes, yes, yes. You may need an egg sandwich. You have the bread and you have your egg. You have your salt and your peppers. Ah, yes, yes. You might have your oil and your frying tin. And everything is ready. Put over one side. Your bread, your egg, your seasoning. Praise God. I hear Elder. Praise God, Elder. Speak about it earlier. Praise God. I've component it. Praise God shortly. Praise God. But your substance is, praise God, the egg, the bread, your seasoning. They are component. It's an ingredient. Praise God. Hallelujah. But the thing is that because you want an egg sandwich. Praise God. But you haven't seen the sandwich yet. You haven't seen the sandwich. But you have the components. You have the bread. You have your egg. You have your peppers. Praise God. But you do not see the sandwich yet. Praise God. But what you need now to see the sandwich, we have to mix things up. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Egg have to be fried. Hallelujah. Bread have to be toast if you eat the toast. Oh, praise God. Then you pop it in the middle. Praise God Almighty. And that sandwich is what you were hoping for. That is faith. That is faith. You have the substance of things. The substance of things. The substance of things. Praise God. The bread, the egg, the oil, their substance. Praise God Almighty. Of what you're hoping for. Praise God Almighty. So, 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 so when we mix, when we, when we put our faith in Jesus Christ now, we can trust him. Hallelujah. He promises, hallelujah, praise God Almighty, that he will be with us to the end of the world. He said he won't leave us nor forsake us. Oh my God, hallelujah. Hallelujah. How am I doing with time? Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. You're worthy. You're worthy. You're worthy. You're worthy. We are talking about the all-powerful God, Jesus Christ, the righteous. Hallelujah. We are not talking about Hallelujah, Muhammad. We are not talking about Confucius. We are not talking about Buddha. We are not talking about Haile Selassie. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are talking about Jesus. Hallelujah. If you trust in those men, then you can overcome the world. You have no power. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You are an overcomer because you believe in Jesus Christ, the righteous. Hallelujah. Oh, yes, 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 yes. He died. Uh, as I saw it many years before he said he was wounded for our transgression. He was bruised for our iniquity. He said the chastisement 
chastisement of our peace was upon him. And by every strive, you are healed. I am healed. Oh, yes, we are overcomers in the name of Jesus Christ. We are overcomers in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Can somebody worship the Lord? Oh, yes, yes. Deliverance. Deliverance is here. Deliverance is here. Oh, he said, whatever you ask Hallelujah. in my name, he said that I'll do it. I'll do it. Faith is not something that we muster up. It's not something that we fight and try to get. Praise God. That is not faith, man. Praise God Almighty. That is not faith. Praise God Almighty. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. We are overcomers. We are overcomers. We are more than conquerors. Who is he that overcomes the world? The apostle asks, who is he that overcomes the world? You and you and you. Yes. Yes, 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 because you, you believe that Jesus is the Son of God. You believe that Jesus is the Christ. If, you, if you're not believing now, you cannot and will not be able to overcome the world. The man of God said, who is he that overcome? Come as the world, but he that believeth that Jesus is the Son of God, incarnated, made flesh God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Who died for our sins. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Who died for the sins of the world. Can somebody wave their hands tonight? Oh, yes. We are overcomers. You are an overcomer. The scripture declared that you are more than conquerors. You are not conquerors. You are more, more than conquerors. Oh my God, hallelujah, hallelujah. I get excited about this. Praise God Almighty. It's not easy to have the most of the faith. It's not easy to have the faith, hallelujah. But faith doesn't work when things are going well. No, faith doesn't work when things are going. Faith works when things get rough. When you have an illness in your body, hallelujah. And the doctor said you have two weeks to live, hallelujah. This is where our faith stand. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. When your house is about to be repossessed, yes, you need faith. Hallelujah, hallelujah. When your child that you have grown up in the faith uh, becomes a drug addict, uh, when your child starts to do some stuff, you need the faith. Hallelujah. This is when we need faith. We need faith when things get rough. That's where faith value. Hallelujah, praise God Almighty. When we give God faith, we receive from heaven. He said, ask anything. He said, ask at verse 14, as I close. He said, and this is the confidence that we have in him, in Jesus Christ. We have confidence in him, that he will come through. He will pour the clearance. Says that to live is for Christ. And to die is gain. The man was ready to die. He said that I'm like a drink offering, ready to pour it out. Hallelujah. He said he had fight that would fight. Oh, yes, 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 yes. He said he have kept the faith. Yes. And this is the confidence that we have in him. That if we ask anything according to his will, he hears us. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. This is all we need to have. Faith mixed with the word of God. Praise God and we can move mountain. Faith mixed with the word of God. We can move mountain. Jesus always commends faith. The woman with the issue of blood pressed through and he commend his faith. The man with his servant being sick, praise God. Jesus said, I've never seen such faith in all Israel. Praise God Almighty faith. He commended 
But the thing is that I find funny is that when he speak to the disciples, he said to them, oh, he of little faith, oh, faithless. That's what he says. Praise God to the disciples. So tonight as believers, praise God, let's, 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 let's get our faith in order. Bishop, everybody has a Jesus, wonderful in name, hallelujah. Let's get our faith in order because we do not need a mountainside faith to move a mustard seed problem. God bless you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Elder Brooks in Jesus' name. Come on, rush up. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Oh, glory be to your name, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. hallelujah Jesus. We glorify your name. We magnify your name. Hallelujah. Jesus, hallelujah. What a full Mighty God, everlasting Father, and the Prince of Peace. We exhort you tonight, Jesus, for there is no one like you, dear God. Uh, there is no other name, no other name but uh, the name of Jesus. Uh, hallelujah. The writer tells us every knee shall bow uh, and every tongue must confess that he is Lord. Hallelujah. We just glorify God tonight and give him praise. Uh, we give him honor tonight for his grace and mercy. Mighty God, mighty God, what a word, what a word, what a word, hallelujah. What a word tonight, hallelujah, that has been spoken to our hearts. Surely we have heard from God, hallelujah. Mighty God, as, as a preacher, hallelujah, expound on faith, hallelujah, for the people of God to know, hallelujah, as the Bible says, um, without faith, without faith, it is impossible to please him, mighty God, for we serve a God, hallelujah, who does amazing things, a God who does miraculous things, hallelujah, so we can put our trust in him and know that he will never fail us, to know that he will never let us down. God bless you tonight. God bless everyone tonight who have tuned in. Hallelujah. On this hallelujah medium, just to hear the words of God, just to honor God and just to glorify God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. We are victors. Hallelujah. Through the power of God. Hallelujah. And as a writer pens it, my faith looks up to thee. Thou blessed Lamb of Calvary, Savior divine. Hear me, Savior, when I pray. Oh, God, we need faith to trust God. Hallelujah. But Jesus tells us, if our faith be as a grain of mustard seed, we can say to many things, hallelujah, be thou moved, and it is cast away into the sea. Hallelujah. That is what we do through the power of the mighty God. So tonight we are trusting God. Hallelujah. We have confidence in God, knowing that he will keep us true. Hallelujah. And as a believer of God, let us continue to walk with, you know, in faith, believing, continue to trust God and to serve God. Hallelujah. Mighty God, as it as, as the topic tonight is saying, our faith overcomes the world. Mighty God, when we were in the world, hallelujah. Mighty God, we were we did the things of the world because we were, we were controlled, hallelujah, by the prince of this world. But we are now being changed. We have now become a new man. And the Bible says, if any man be in Christ, is a new creature. If me tell you say. Oh, Hallelujah, Jesus. Nicodemus came to Jesus to ask him. But Jesus told him, Hallelujah, you must be born again. Hallelujah. And any man, hallelujah, that is in the world today, hallelujah, need to have a born again experience. Hallelujah, need to come to Jesus Christ. Hallelujah, as this, as this speaker, hallelujah, has preached tonight and told you where he's coming from. Mighty God, I'm saying tonight to someone, if you have not accepted Jesus Christ, there is an invitation. There is one who cares for you. There is one who concerned about you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, he's concerned about your welfare. He's concerned about your future. He's concerned about your inheritance, hallelujah, in eternity. Oh God, Jesus, hallelujah, offers life eternal. Hallelujah. He offers life eternal. So if tonight, if you have been seeking in the word, hallelujah, and you have not found comfort, hallelujah, because the things of the world, mighty God, will give you a quick fix. 
but Jesus offers a permanent fix. Hallelujah. When you come to Jesus Christ, uh, hallelujah, he will mend your broken heart. Uh, hallelujah. He can make that which is wrong right. Hallelujah. He will give you a direction. Hallelujah. That you know how to live. Uh, hallelujah. That you know how to serve him as your master. Is there one tonight? Hallelujah. Who do not know God? Do not have Jesus Christ as your savior. This is an invitation. This is an altar call. Hallelujah. Jesus Christ is offering eternal life. Hallelujah. Because we know for sure that he's coming. Hallelujah. He's coming back again. He left the word and he told us. Hallelujah. He's coming back to receive those who have accepted him. Hallelujah. Those who have committed their lives to him. Oh God. Hallelujah. And we know that the coming of the God is sure. His words are sure. Hallelujah. He is a God who, who lives according to his words. Hallelujah. He honors his words. Hallelujah. For he tells us his words, mighty God, it, it will not, it must accomplish. Mighty God, he told us as well. Hallelujah. Before his words passed away, he said, not even a jot of his, or a tittle of his word to show us how he honors his word. It says, heaven and earth will pass away, but his words will not pass away. Tonight, Jesus hallelujah, has an open door waiting for anyone tonight who want to receive him. Oh, God, just to give their life to him. The words of God, hallelujah, we are here, hallelujah, ministering the words, hallelujah, for those who need to come to Christ. It's important that you accept Jesus Christ in your life, hallelujah, to spend your eternity with him, hallelujah, in paradise. Oh God, hallelujah. Hell is not a nice place, hallelujah. I've never been there, but I have heard and I believe, hallelujah, hallelujah, that all the torments, hallelujah, that I've heard of, it's a reality. Will you refuse this invitation? Will you refuse this privilege tonight? Tomorrow may be too late, hallelujah. No one, tomorrow is not promised to any man. But tonight, the Bible said, now is the time, the acceptable time. Hallelujah. Come to Jesus Christ. Give your life to him. Hallelujah. For there is life in the look of the crucified one. There is life at this moment. Hallelujah, Jesus. When you die, we do you want to spend your eternity? Jesus, hallelujah, is knocking at your heart door. Hallelujah. If you hear Hallelujah, if I heard these words tonight. Praise God. If there's one tonight, hallelujah, who want to accept Jesus Christ, who want to give your life, want to make a change, want to become a new person. Oh God, hallelujah, want to forget the old things of this world. Hallelujah, which is just misery. Hallelujah. Oh God, if you want to make a change in your life, hallelujah, you can place it in the chat right now. Place it in the chat. Hallelujah, or you can just hold your hand up. Hallelujah. We're going to close this meeting very shortly. Oh, God. Hallelujah. Time is of essence. Time is of great importance. Hallelujah. Do not let time run out on you. Hallelujah. This may be your last chance. Oh, God. And God hallelujah. God is calling out to you. He said, behold, I knock at the door. If any man will hear my voice, I open, I will come in and I will sup with him. Jesus Christ, I tell you tonight. He offers, hallelujah, all that is good in life, peace, contentment, and joy. You may be looking for satisfaction in some other places, but I tell you tonight, I recommend it to you, Jesus Christ, hallelujah, who has life eternal, hallelujah, who have good things, hallelujah, in store for those who come to him. Praise God, I, I've experienced him. And I've received blessings from God. Hallelujah. Blessings that are overflowing. Hallelujah. You can do the same tonight. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you tonight. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. God bless you tonight. Hallelujah. This is a chance. Make your mind up. Hallelujah. For Christ is speaking to your heart tonight. In Jesus' holy name. In Jesus' holy name. Praise God. I'm going to pray tonight. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, praise God, hallelujah, hallelujah. And I just want, hallelujah, us all, hallelujah, just to believe God tonight. 
Hallelujah. Just open up our hearts. Hallelujah. And if there is one, if there's a backslider tonight, oh God, hallelujah, have walked away from the presence of God. Hallelujah, this is your chance to come back to God. Hallelujah, he will not reject you. Hallelujah, he will in no wise cast away. If they that come to him, he will in no wise cast away. Open your heart at this moment to receive Christ in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah, Jesus, hallelujah. We just bow our head at this time, praise God. Eternal Father God, hallelujah. We glorify your mighty name, Jesus. Father God, we adore you. Hallelujah, we exalt you for you are God, Heavenly Father, Jesus. Oh God, the giver of life, Holy Father, the, the oh God, the omnipotent one, hallelujah. For our power is given unto you in heaven and in earth, Father. We glorify your name, Jesus. Lord, without you, we can do nothing. Without you, God, hallelujah, God, we cannot live. Oh, God, because, mighty God, the breath that we breathe, it comes from you, dear Father. And Jesus, we don't want to take you for granted, dear Father, Jesus. But God, hallelujah, dear Father, God, we just want to, God, tell you that we appreciate you for all that you have done, Father. Thank you, Lord God, for this plan of salvation, dear Jesus that you came into the world and you died for sinful men, men like us, dear Father Jesus, who never knew you. Mighty God, I pray tonight, Jesus, that you bless the heart of every soul, mighty God, that have tuned in tonight, dear Father. Hallelujah, God, to hear your words, mighty God, and those who have participated, hallelujah. I pray tonight, God, for your blessing, hallelujah, for your anointing, God, upon your people, Jesus. Lord God, have your own way, God, in the lives of your people, dear Father. Mighty God, I pray you break down strongholds, dear God. I pray you break down, mighty God, principalities and powers. Uh, Jesus, and set your people free, God. Many are born, dear Father, God, in sin. Many are born, mighty God, in grave clothes, Father God. But I pray you loose them, God, and set them free. Set God, hallelujah, dear Father, God, the heart of sinners free. Oh, God, release them, God, from the chains uh, and from the shackles, mighty God, that keep them, oh, God, addicted and adjusted to the word, Father. Set your people free. Give grace, give peace, contentment, God, in the mind of your people, Father. For Jesus, without you, God, we are nothing. Help us to realize, God, that our life comes from you, dear Father, and we live because of you. Bless our hearts tonight, God. Take full control. Lead and direct us, God, in all that we do. We ask these mercies, mighty God, and say thanks in Jesus' holy name. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. Can we all just lift our hands tonight and just glorify God? Hallelujah. Let's lift our hands in the sanctuary and glorify God. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Amen. Yes, Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Glory. Back over to you, El Horton. God bless. Thank you, Jesus. Praise the Lord. At this time, I hand over to the host pastor, Bishop C.T. Richards. Jesus. Glory. Bless the Lord, everyone. Bless God. Amen. We give God praise tonight and honor. Amen. For listening to the words of God. Amen. If we are blessed tonight, just clap your hands. Just clap your hands. Bless God. Bless God. What a mighty, mighty God we serve. Amen. This is the starting of our first night of convocation. Amen. And the Lord has really blessed us. Speak to us. Amen. Through his words. And we continue to pray. Amen. For these young men as they come up in the gospel of Jesus Christ, amen, that God will bless them and continue to keep them in his state. And we just continue one with another, amen. Give God thanks for the first night, amen. And I give God thanks for our moderator this evening, amen, who had took us through this evening, amen. And God has blessed her and keep her Amen. And we are able to sit down and listen to the words of God. Isn't it wonderful? Amen. There are times that we, we seem to be running away. What tonight we could sit down and listen to the words of God. 
Amen. And I, I just pray that God will continue to bless the, the preacher. Amen. And keep him in his own hand. In times like these, amen, we need young men and women. Bless God. Not only young men, but we need young men and women to stand up for the gospel of Jesus Christ. And as the word of God tells us, amen, that our faith, our faith, amen, our faith overcomes the world. And because Christ lives within you and I, and because of the, the little effort that we have made, amen, Jesus Christ becomes our full power, amen, and can take us through our endeavors at times when it seems as though we would fail. So we give God thanks for this evening, amen, and we are going to close at this time, and please remember, amen, I'm sure that there are some announcements before we, we close, amen. So I just ask a missionary, amen. All right. If you've got any announcements, uh, uh, Missionary Barrett, if you've got any announcement, I know that you're in the sanctuary, but I'm sure that we can have some announcements before we go. Amen. In Jesus' name. Yes. Praise the Lord. God bless you. Thank you, Bishop Richards. Just to announce that we will continue in fellowship and what worship. Picture that. Praise God. We will continue in fellowship and worship. Um, tomorrow in the sanctuary, which is Church of Jesus Christ Apostolic 778, Prince of Wales Road, Darnall, Sheffield S94 EU. If you need to get here using a sat nav, if you put the postcode in S94 QD, then we will be here from 5 p.m. And the same again for Sunday, we will start. Um, Praise and worship will start at 11.30 and will continue until 12.30 for another wonderful service in the Lord. God bless you. Please join us in Jesus' name. Bless the Lord. Thank you. Thank you for that. Amen. And I'm sure that uh, we can go to bed tonight. Amen. With the word, the word, their spirit and their life. Amen. And I'm looking forward, if we have tomorrow, amen, that we will be listening also to the words of God tomorrow as well, amen, if God permits. But one thing we have to do is when we are in the house of God, the time that we are there, just bask on the full salvation that God has given us because we do not know if there is a tomorrow. So God bless us tonight. And the Lord keep us in the name of Jesus Christ and just pronounce the benediction as we close. Now may the saving grace of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, the love of God, the fellowship, the Holy Spirit comforter, rest, remain, abide with us all now and forevermore. And let us all say, Amen. Amen. You can unmute and greet one another, those that you can see in Jesus' name. God bless you. God bless you.